Hello there, welcome to the channel. Here I'm going to show you an update in my pre-search nodes, what, uh, what's been happening these couple of months. And if you're new to pre, the link in the description where you can sign up and you receive your 25 pre for free once you start using it for 30 days. So as you can see here, the first, the price of pre has been increasing. It's been blowing up, which is great. And also it's been going up, which is nice. So this will be a great time to start any extra pre that you have. You would probably want to keep it in your nodes, increase the minimum stake. So as you can see the reason why for this. So if you go to one of my nodes here, to one of my nodes here, I'm gonna show you. So this is one of my nodes, uh, my nodes here from San Jose, California. It's currently at 6,000 pre. The minimum mistake is 4,000, uh, bumped it up to 2,000 more. The extra amount is 2,000 pre. Total is 6,000 pre. And I'll show you the reason why I do this. So as this one is pre-4, you go back to the list. So go to pre-4, this one's based in the US. 6,000 as I previously talked about. Attempted request and attempt uh, successful request and rewarded request. Good numbers and reliability score is 84. And the total amount earned 503. Let's go to the stats here. So here we have 6,000 pre. So here's the most important. We go to the, the server statistics. So which is speed, latency, the average success rates over 98%. Reliability score is 84.4. And as you can see here, the amount of pre earned is seven and a half pre, which is great because I keep in mind I also did increase the minimum stake. Instead of 4,000, I added 2,000 extra pre. So if you have 1,000, 2,000, or even 3,000 pre that it's not staked, my recommendation would be to use that extra pre that's currently not being used to increase your minimum stake amount to your node to increase your earnings and helping the network increase your earnings. If you wish to do so, this is what I've done. I added to my, pre my existing nodes to increase the minimum stake and you get rewarded by doing so. So that's what that's one of my node. Let's go to another one. And so you could see, I'm gonna show you now here another pre amount. So he, here is another one. See this one's located in Europe, my 6,000 staked. Pre 19, this one's located in New York. Reliability score is at 81. And let's go stake to see the stats of this pre node. So as you can see here, the latency is much a little bit much higher. Also the reliability score is 80.7. It's acceptable. And the total earned amount 6.4 pre keep in mind that also did staked over the 4000 minimum so the total amount staked for this particular node is 2000 over the minimum stake amount total amount of pre 6000 pre staked so an example you do earn a little bit more by staking so it, it's beneficial for the node operators and keep in mind that the scarcity of pre will be eventually be as you can see the circling supplies at 79 percent the amount of pre that's being consumed and stored or even mostly staked. Half of the supply is already staked, so it's nice and locked, which is great. You're able to withdraw your pre-staked, but it, it does take some time, up to two business days, I believe. If you know the exact amount, feel free to comment below to let others know the exact amount of how much, you, how much pre you can withdraw. So if you go to more info here, you'll see the amount of wallets currently being created to store and transfer pre to stake on the dash Nord dashboard. As more users create their wallets, more transparent and equitable search experience gets known where user data is protected and users are rewarded for their engagement. In addition to the traditional search functionality, the pre-search platform also features a marketplace where users can buy and sell advertising and other products and services using pre-tokens. By providing an alternative to centralized search engines like Google, pre-search aims to empower users and support a more decentralized and user-driven internet. If you'd like to know more about pre-search, the link will be in the description and check it out. Feel free to comment below if you have any questions regarding pre. They have weekly MMAs, but when you have a question for pre-search, feel free to ask them on their YouTube channel as well as their Odyssey channel as well. Ask your question Thursday or before. If you ask it on the same day, the question will not be answered. And also keep in mind, you also have VPS calls, virtual private server, which to reduce the amount of your earnings, your net earnings. So I recommend using uh, the ones that I use. I like to use Rack Nerd. They're very good, very affordable. If you need a good deal, I have the link in the description and I'll show you how much they I get charged so you can see the amount, full amount. And here you go, the link will be in the description for that discount. Once you click on the link in the description for Rack Nerd, get a good deal of $10.28 per year. 
which is about 85 cents per month for running one pre-search node. And that also be a video on how to set up a pre-search node using Rat Nerd. The link will be in the description as well. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments below and I'll try my best to answer them. And so this will limit also your VPS costs monthly as well as annually. The more you have, the more expensive it gets. So keep that in mind as well. That's how I run my pre-search nodes daily. Now you know. And also check out the video playlist about pre and also another video on passive income methods that I use on the daily at the end of this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.